Hari Om Tat Sat. Please get ready for the practice of Yoga Nidra. Lie on the floor with your body in a straight line. Have your feet slightly apart, falling to the outsides. Have your arms close to but not touching the body. Preferably with the palms turned upwards. Check the position of your head, neck and shoulders. Head and neck should be in line with the spinal column. Lightly close your eyes and your mouth. And make any necessary adjustments so that your body is perfectly relaxed on the floor. Make yourself as comfortable as possible. Make sure there are no areas of tightness caused by your clothing or coverings or the holding of any particular muscles in a tense way like the fists. Spend a few moments checking the position of your whole body and make any final adjustments so that you can lie motionless for the duration of the Yoga Nidra practice. During Yoga Nidra, there has to be some effort made to keep listening to my instructions. Keep following. You'll be functioning on the levels of feeling and awareness. And have in your mind the attitude that you are going to do yoga nidra practice. That you will try not to sleep. and maintain this awareness right through. Be aware of the whole body lying on the floor. Take a deep breath in now. Expand the lungs to capacity. And as you exhale, be aware of letting go. With one deep breath, let go on a physical level. On a second deep breath, let go on an emotional level. On a third deep breath, let go on a mental level. On completion of the deep breathing, spend a short time simply observing the natural breath. Feel the breath moving into and out of the body. With the inhalation, the navel rises slightly. With the exhalation, it falls. Observe this movement. It's effortless, it's spontaneous. Merge your awareness with the rhythm of your breath. And then leave the awareness of your breath and for a short time listen to all the different sounds going on around you. Put all your attention into listening. Keep your awareness active and alert. I know I am listening 
to sounds, moving from one sound to another. Listen for sounds that are close to you and also more distant sounds. Sounds from all directions. And then leave the awareness of listening. At this point in the practice, we make a sankalpa, a resolution. A resolution is something which is important to you, a goal, an aim that you have in your life. And a sankalpa is always made in positive language. I will do something. I will be something. If you have not previously made a sankalpa, you can spend some time considering a suitable one for yourself. If you already have a sankalpa, repeat it to yourself three times, say it with confidence, say it with clarity. Then leave the sankalpa, allow it to rest in the depths of your mind. Be aware consciously of your physical body lying on the floor. Have a quick mental impression of the whole body lying on the floor and follow as I name the different parts of your body. As I name each part, try to visualize the part, feel where it is without moving it. And you may also repeat the name of the part to yourself mentally. Start on the right side of the body. Become aware of your right hand thumb. Index finger on the right hand, middle finger, ring finger, small finger. Palm of the right hand back of the hand, right wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, right shoulder, right side of the waist, right hip, thigh, knee, calf, ankle, heel of the right foot, the sole, Top of the foot, right big toe, second, third, fourth, fifth toe. Be aware of the whole right foot, the whole right leg, the whole right arm, the whole right side of the body. Go to the left side. Check that you're listening, that you are awake. Be aware of the left thumb, index finger, middle finger, ring finger, small finger. Left palm, back of the hand, wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, 
left shoulder, left side of the waist, left hip, thigh, knee, calf, ankle, heel of the left foot, sole, top of the left foot, left big toe, second, third toe, fourth and fifth. Be aware of the whole left foot, the whole left leg, the whole left arm, the whole left side of your body. Shift your awareness to the back of the body. Be aware of the right buttock, left buttock, small of the back, right side of the back, left side, right shoulder blade, left shoulder blade, whole back, whole spinal cord, the back of the neck, the back of the head, the top of the head, move your awareness down the front side, become aware of your right ear, left ear, right temple, left temple, whole forehead, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, eyebrow center, right eyelid, left eyelid, right eye, left eye, right cheek, left cheek, right nostril, left nostril, the nose tip, upper lip, lower lip, chin, the jawline from ear to ear, throat, right collarbone, left collarbone, the whole right side of the chest, the left side, the whole chest, upper abdomen, navel, lower abdomen and pelvis. Now become aware of the major parts of your body. Become aware of the whole right leg, the whole left leg, right arm and the left arm, both legs and both arms together, the whole abdomen, chest, whole back and head. Become aware of both legs, both arms, abdomen, chest, back and head. Be aware of the whole body. Have a clear awareness of the whole body as one homogeneous unit. Awareness of the whole body from head to toe, whole body, whole body. and focus now on the spinal column. Be aware of the spinal cord. And we will move the awareness to the chakra points along the spine. Become aware of Muladhar Chakra the base chakra. At the perineum in males, at the cervix in females. The center of the earth element. Become aware of this point. Move your awareness to the very base of the spine near the coccyx to Swadhisthan chakra. 
directly behind the pubic bone in the spine, Swadhisthan, the center of the water element. Move your awareness up the spine. Directly behind the navel is located Manipur. Manipur chakra is the center of fire. Move your awareness up. Behind the sternum, in the spinal column, is Anahat chakra, the center of the air element. Moving up directly behind the pit of the throat in the spine to Vishuddhi Chakra. Vishuddhi, the center of the ether element or space, center of purification. Moving up to the very top of the spinal cord Directly behind the eyebrow center in the midbrain is Agya Chakra, center of consciousness related to intuition and discrimination. And then move to the back of the head beyond the spine the back of the head where the hair begins to grow to Bindu Visarg a point related to the seat of the individual consciousness and then move up to the very top of the head the crown chakra Sahasra related to universal consciousness. We will take the awareness back down from Sahasra, moving back down to Bindu, the back of the head. Agya, the top of the spine in the midbrain. Vishuddhi, behind the throat. Anahat, behind the sternum. Manipur, behind the navel. Swadhisthan, behind the pubic bone. And back to Muladha, the base chakra. Maintaining the awareness of the whole spine at all the chakra points, start to become aware of your breath. With inhalation, take your awareness from Muladhar up through Swadhisthan, Manipur, Anahat, Vishuddhi, Agya, Bindu to Sahasra on inhalation. And as you exhale, the awareness descends from Sahasra to Bindu, Agya, Vishuddhi, Anahat, Manipur, Swadhisthan, reaching Muladhar. Continue to watch and follow the breath in this manner, ascending with inhalation in the spine descending with exhalation. Try to be aware of every breath you take.
continue following the breath through the chakra points and also begin to mentally repeat the mantra Om. Mentally repeat Om with the inhalation from Mulata up to Sahasra. And again repeating Om with the exhalation from Sahasra down to Mulata. Maintain the awareness of the breath, the psychic passage between Mulata and Sahasra and the mantra Om. And then leave this awareness, leave the breath, leave the mantra, leave the spinal cord. Focus on the space in front of your closed eyes. For a short time, become the witness. Observe the inner space. allowing your mind to be completely free, allowing whatever thoughts and impressions are there to come onto the screen of the mind and also to pass. Observing without judgment, without suppression, without expectation. Simply accepting and watching. And then within this inner space, practice visualization. Visualize the jyoti, the inner lamp, and see the soft, steady flame of the jyoti and have the totality of your awareness focused on this symbol. The symbol of your inner consciousness. The consciousness which observes all the variety of experiences of life and yet remains unaffected and steady. Keep the image of the Jyoti as clearly as possible in front of your closed eyes. And then leave this internal image. Recall your sankalpa, which you may have made in the beginning of the practice. Repeat the sankalpa, the resolution to yourself, three times. 
Say it with conviction and determination. And then allow the Sankalpa to rest once more. Bring your consciousness, conscious awareness back to your breath. Feel the breath moving in your body. and extend your awareness to your whole body. Feel your body in contact with the floor and begin to develop an awareness of your surroundings. Be aware of where you are. Be aware that you've been practicing Yoga Nidra. The practice is coming to a close. Very slowly you can begin to move your fingers and your toes. Slowly and gently beginning to wake up. Move your fingers and toes. Gently move your head from side to side and you can take a deep breath and stretch your arms above your head stretching the whole body Haryom Tat Sat Haryom Tat Sat Hari Om Tat Sat. The practice of Yoga Nidra is complete.